Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby, your daily call to prayer. Pray with us every day right here on the podcast and in your inbox. Learn more at morningoffering.com. Greetings, friends. Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby. It is Friday, July 5th, and today I'd like to talk about making promises. But first, let's pray together. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. O oh, Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your sacred heart in union with the holy sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world, for the salvation of souls, the reparation of sins, the reunion of all Christians, and in particular for the intentions of the Holy Father this month. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, friends, we know that as Christian believers, we are called to exercise the virtue of integrity. Now, integrity has many different expressions, one of which is the making of promises. That when we say we're going to do something or not do something or be somewhere or not be somewhere, when we make a promise as Christians, we are bound to fulfill it. The Lord tells us to be cautious about making promises. He tells us, let your yes mean yes, and your no mean no. Because when we make a promise, we have to fulfill what we have said. So long as that promise is within faith and morals, We are bound to do it. Now, this is very important in general. It's particularly important in today's world. Because, friends, we live in a world of lies. People will say anything. Talk has become very cheap. People will lie. They will deceive. They will manipulate. They will do whatever they have to in order to get what they want or to get out of trouble. And in the midst of a culture of deception, we are called to be a people of integrity. In the midst of darkness, as Christians, we are always called to be the light because we follow Jesus Christ, the light of the world. And so when we make a promise, we have to fulfill it. This is why, again, we should be cautious about making promises. But people will know that we have spoken and made a promise, and we are Christians, they will have certainty that it will be done, that what we have promised to do will be done. That's the virtue that we take so seriously. That's our life of integrity. So again, in the midst of deception, Let's be the voice of honesty, sincerity, the voice of integrity. That's the Christian way. That's how we're called to live. If we make a promise, we're called to fulfill it. Those are our thoughts for today, dear friends. I want to thank you for joining me. I encourage you, keep fighting the good fight. And remember, you can receive daily spiritual encouragement sent right to your inbox when you subscribe to The Morning Offering at morningoffering.com. God bless you. Thanks for listening today. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. The Morning Offering with Father Kirby is a production of Good Catholic, the media division of The Catholic Company. For more faith-filled podcasts and videos, visit goodcatholic.com.